Hey everybody, Heather Campbell here. Today I've got another video for Ellen Hudson and today's video is all about adhesives. So when I first started crafting, I was very overwhelmed by the amount of uh, adhesive material that was out there on the market and I didn't quite know what I needed or when. Um, so I thought it'd be fun to have a little video that shared just a little bit about the different adhesives that would help get you started and when you would use them. So this is the Advanced Tape Glider by Scotch. This thing is a mammoth and it holds loads of adhesives, which is great. Uh, it's also incredibly strong and pretty precise. It's easy to apply it when exactly where you need it once you get the hang of it. Uh, as you can see, it's very sticky and you can see the little lines of tape. Um, so you would use something like this for holding two pieces of paper together. It could be cardstock to cardstock or pattern paper to cardstock. Um, you can use it for paper piecing, all sorts of different techniques. So the next little product I've got here is this little sticky dot runner. Now this is a smaller tape runner. Some of these are refillable and some of them aren't and often that you will be able to find them in different patterns. So this is a dot runner and um, it's really preference. They work pretty much the same, but this one is much, much smaller and you will go through these much, much faster. So it's really whatever you, um, whatever you like better. Um, I've got both. I use both. It's pretty much whatever's on my craft desk and within reach. <laughs> um, but as you can see, I'm going to use it essentially the same. Um, I've got a piece of pattern paper and I'm just going to add that um, tape runner, that little glue adhesive um, to the back of that card or the pattern paper. And there you see it um, functions the pretty much the same way. So next is dimensional foam. Now you can find dimensional foam in the big rolls like this, or you can find it in um, smaller little sheets that come into pre-cut squares. I really love these big rolls, uh, but I also like the little squares too. Um, both work great, but here I am using that dimensional foam to pop that entire layer up. And there you can see how uh, it pops everything up. Next, I've got this little hydrangea from the Essentials by Ellen Mondo Hydrangea, which I love, and I've got it pre-stamped and watercolored. Um, and so you can see I'm using that same foam, but just positioning it behind each of the stamped images, uh, cut into little smaller pieces, and I'm able to use it the exact same way. So that is uh, dimensional foam. I wanted to talk about some liquid adhesives. So this is the Ranger Multimedia Matte and the Tombow Mono Adhesive. So either one work essentially the same way. I've had uh, great results with both. So I use them pretty interchangeably. And I use these for adding embellishments to my card. So here you can see I've added some sequins that are the Sparkling Clear by Pretty Pink Posh. And when I use this, I just put little dots on my card and then bring the sequins to them. The other adhesive that I use quite frequently are glue dots. Now I love this mini glue dot size and my little trick here is that I bring my sequin to the glue dot and then I push it down with my thumb and then I bring it over to my card. Um, so I find that this is yet another type of adhesive that I use quite frequently as well. So there you have it. It's a little bit about adhesives. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Have a great day. Bye.